This is Brian with ScreenFiles.com with Trailer Into Reaction. What dropped today was a teaser trailer for Spiral from the Book of Saul, <laughs> which I am not aware of existing. But in any case, I think it's a clever way to continue the Saul franchise. And this is, I believe, co-written by Chris Rock, comedian Chris Rock, who has directed quite a few movies of his own, so he's not an unproven talent. Though, how the hell they got Samuel Jackson to play in a Saw movie at this stage of his career is just a remarkable thing because I'm going to put this out there. This may be one of the highest grossing Saw movies ever made. Why is that? Again, Samuel Jackson. He's, he's a weird hybrid actor in the sense that he's very much a character actor but he's also an a-list actor as well and just the fact that he's in the movie is going to do some very interesting things for its box office i'm predicting so in any case let's take a look at a teaser trailer for spiral from the book of saul i said saul i meant to say spiral from the book of saul not the Book of Saul or the Book of Mormon. Let's take a look. What do you got there? Oh, it's just my wife, Emma. This is my son, Charlie. Enjoy a lot less. Well, less. Nothing happier than the wife of a new detective. Emma's cool, man. She's different. You don't know my wife. You give a woman 600 Tuesdays. It ain't worth three Saturday nights. How much money you got? A lot. How many problems you got? A lot. How many people have doubted? A lot. All available lot. units, right. officer down. Pray that you flop. Detective Banks and route. Whoever did this has another motive. They're targeting cops. This shit's gonna go sideways fast. Someone's out there pulling all the strings. You want to play games, motherfucker? Well, that was the trailer for Spiral from the Book of Saul. And I should mention it was directed by Darren Lynn Bowsman, who's actually directed films in the Saw franchise prior to this one. But... I've never been a huge fan of the Saw movies. I thought the original was an interesting movie. It wasn't, it was actually kind of irritating in some ways, but it was well done. It was tense. It had very much atmosphere to it. Later, the franchise pretty much started to go off the rails. It started to get silly, and it started to become invested more in, let's find some interesting ways we can kill people. Interesting as in graphic pulpy ways we can kill people as opposed to i don't know an interesting storyline that just happens to have very violent graphic deaths in it so i have to admit i'm curious about this i have never been one to see saw movies in the theater at least after the first one or two but i could see myself seeing this it looks interesting it's early days yet but it's a possibility this is brian with screenfiles.com and trailing to reaction peace